Hey guys, it's Sean Veely here, and I got my first, um, well, I actually have a vinyl collection already. This is just the first one I'm unboxing here. This is, um, the best Red Hot Chili Peppers album they ever released, California Cation. It's a limited edition picture disc, and this is actually a new copy I just got from Walmart.com. However, it's not sealed up or nothing. It's just in this clear plastic sleeve. <laughs> oh, technically, I guess this, the way it sticks. Let's see. No, it wasn't sealed. It's just closed up in there. Go ahead. See, it says special 20th anniversary limited picture disc of the seminal six-time platinum and Grammy Award winning album. So, yeah, because it came out in 99. So, this is 2019. So, yeah, that's anniversary. That's my favorite picture of it there on the front because that's what the original album cover looks like. And I always found that pretty because it's like ocean or swimming pool right there and that's like lava or something or maybe that's supposed to represent global warming or something because they are liberal but um let's see so that was side a right there or side one says side two let's see it looks like chad right there or no that's um Anthony right there, yeah, and I think Flea, probably, because that's Josh, I think, yeah, Josh, because John was, John didn't come back until later on, but yeah, that's Chad, and then right here is all four of them, I think I can spot Anthony right there, because that's the lead singer of the group, but yeah, it's got the original year right there, Let's see, that's the song, my favorite song on here, I like those four there, and let's see, Get On Top and Californication, also pretty good, Exit Remus, Purple Stain, Road Trippin', I like that, on Around the World, Parallel Universe, Scar Tissue, Other Side, those are some of the classic ones on here, but yeah, so it is kind of sealed, I guess, it's got these little sticker things here, but still not shrink wrapped or nothing looks like it actually re-sticks on there so like that so that's pretty cool did stick these in here pretty good so even though they didn't seal them they did stick them in there good so at least they did that but what am i doing i need to get this one out first i don't want to get copyrighted so i'm not really gonna play the album if i put it on the vinyl thing i'll have to mute it but let's just take it out and look at it for now Looks very nice. You can see the lines there where the, the grooves where each song is. That's the front there. So that's the first one there. And then let's look at this other one here. Maybe stuck a little tighter. Yeah. This one's stuck tighter in there, but there we go. Let's see. Like how some of it's in black and white, and then the others ones here in color. Well, yeah. One's in color, the others are in black and white. That's still cool, though. Yeah, I put that one back in there backwards, so I gotta fix that. I'm about to play the first one anyway, so it won't really matter, but... I'm actually gonna upgrade soon. That's the vinyl player I got over there. So, I mean, it's okay, but... It's not that good. Speakers and everything. It's a cheap one. The Crossley ones, I mean... They're okay, but I like a, a, one made out of wood or something. Not that plastic stuff. But this is actually another Red Hot Chili Peppers one I got here on the limited edition blue one just a few days ago called Unlimited Love. So I'm going to slip that one back into the case. And thankfully it's not a gatefold case. I'm like that Harry Styles one I got there. 
because um I'm gonna tell y'all why I don't like date folds in a minute and why these are better like this and that one's also good I mean that's a gate fold but it's made out of clear plastic so it's still easier to close that's one main reason why but I'm gonna show you what that gate fold does in a minute I mean yeah looks like a transparent blue that one is but um hold on yeah Okay, so this is the reason why I don't like gate folds on this um, Harry Styles vinyl. As you can see, look at this. What happens when I pick it up or lay it down. See, it's like it bends all up and stuff. Doesn't want to stay closed. Then you open it up and see that's why the gate fold won't right there. But see what it does? That's why I hate gate fold vinyls right there. That's, you can tell that's cheap right there and not good when it does that. See, it's even bending in the back, so that's why I hate gatefold ones. If you make a vinyl, I want it like this. Or if you make it a gatefold, do the plastic like that, so. Yeah, guys, hold on. I'm gonna, you'll see my face a minute. I'm gonna put this vinyl back up over here. So, I'm going to pull this vinyl out here. Yeah. So, yeah, that's my favorite one so far. All the nice color on it. The best side of it. Plus, like I said, this was what the original cover looked like. There was no warning label on it. But some of their albums didn't have the warning labels, even though they needed it. Like, Unlimited Love had some explicit tracks. This has some explicit tracks. Although, Walmart did label it as that one. Order it from there. Probably the only online website that did, besides the streaming platforms. They finally put an E by Around the World. That one needed one for a while, so they put the E by it. Purple Stain definitely needs one by it, but Purple Stain just had mild language, so that's probably why they didn't put it by there. And then Get On Top had the strong language, so they put it on that one. But, uh, yes, so, not, so avoid getting copyrighted, I'm just gonna play the beginning part of it and then turn it off. Yeah, speakers aren't that good on it. Alright. I'm just pulling it up there. That's the end, first few seconds of it. Trying not to get copyrighted. So, that's all I'm going to play of it. But yeah, I hope y'all enjoyed this video. Um, Subscribe to my channel. And I'll see y'all next time.